An Arlington woman says she's been making masks at home for family and for sale since the pandemic began. Now, less than two hours away from Tarrant County's new mask order going into effect, she says she's ramped up her sewing machine yet again. I have a whole stack here of material. And I can turn them out pretty fast. Luann Wilmoth says at her top speed, she's cranking out about five of these masks an hour. So I've made over 300. And now with Tarrant County's order in effect, she is fully expecting to be making many more of these in the coming days. It's hard to keep them in hand only because now we're going to have to start wearing the mask. So I'm going to have to start making more. She's become very good at making these masks from her home here in Arlington, but Wilmoth's main hobby is quilting. Like many other people during the pandemic, she has also retooled her skills and her equipment to help meet a more immediate need. But I am doing it strictly because I want to help people and it gives me something to do. Her first batch to friends and family was given out for free, but then she began selling them for about $5 each just to recoup some of the cost of materials and labor. Now... But I have bins of material that I use as my, my stock. She's ready to go, as the demand for her masks will surely surge. I think they're going to be scrambling for masks, and... Uh, there are lots and lots of us making them, and I hope everybody wears one. She says both she and her husband are immunocompromised, and she can't stress enough the importance of wearing a face covering, whether it's hers or ones made by someone else. I think for your protection, my protection, we need to wear the mask. Well, the mask order again goes into effect tonight at 6 o'clock, and it will last through August 3rd.